Hi, Steve Ward here with Mercedes-Benz of London. I'm here with James Batestis. Hi, James. Hey, let's uh, jump into your office here. I'm going to ask you a few questions. Sure. James is a, sales, a professional uh, certified sales associate here at Mercedes-Benz of London. So, James, uh, when did you start here at Mercedes-Benz of London? It's been about, uh, what are we going on, almost two years now. Two years. And what did you do before you uh, came to this uh, beautiful abode? <laughs> owned a restaurant uh, okay. here in Salt Lake for almost 14 years. Wow. Uh, which was fun uh, while it lasted, but uh, I was burned out. And everybody that knows the restaurant business knows it's a tough business. So, um, I kind of didn't have a life away from it. So, uh I had an opportunity here, and I'd driven, uh, I've owned about nine to ten Mercedes prior um, to working here, so I know the product really well, and I believe in the product, and so I kind of come from the customer's side of it, which is kind of interesting, but uh, but that's kind of how I ended up here, uh, because I bought my cars from uh, the sales manager that works here, and so he said, hey, come down and try this, and so here I'm at. Awesome. So what are some of the things that uh, you learned uh, with your experience in the uh, restaurant business that you're carrying over here into the automotive business? Well, um, first of all, uh, I think you learn a lot when you own a business, because you see kind of the back end of it. So. Um, I think you learn a lot there, but uh, one thing going to this business, being on the sales side of it, from being a customer on the customer's end of it, is the sales side's a lot more involved than you think, uh, which makes it kind of fun, and it's harder than you think, which so it's kind of challenging, but uh, but it takes a while if you can hang in there, and I've done that, mm -hmm. so, uh, but it's fun, as you know, Steve. <laughs> yeah, I know James does a great job here at Mercedes-Benz. You also uh, have a big responsibility with the Sprinter vans, is that I true? I do, so unfortunately we lost Rodney, which uh, he passed away from cancer, and uh, so I took that over from him, which is a great opportunity, but that's then again another learning process uh, because the product is it's a great product but uh, these vans you can do so many things to them there's so many different upfits and things you can do with the vans that there's a big learning curve because there's a lot it's not just about the van but it's about you know um, all these things you can do to them and and it is a major learning process but I've enjoyed that too and um, the product uh, you know they're doing a lot of new things with the product in fact also they're going to be coming out um, hopefully it'll be 16, but they're going to have a, like a mid-size van, which will be under the Sprinter. It's called the V-Series, which is going to be a little bit bigger than a minivan, and it just looks awesome. It's going to be an awesome product. It's going to have a four-cylinder turbo engine in it. Um, it's going to get, you know, in the mid-30s fuel economy, and uh, I think it's going to be a great vehicle. Um, and you know on the regular Mercedes size, Steve, that they're coming out with a lot of great product. I do. They never have before, so I think it's a fun time to be with Mercedes. I agree. James, let me ask you one more question. Uh, you know, we tout this certification, this we're certified sales professionals. What does that mean? What does it involve to become certified? <laughs> Well, uh, I think, you know, it's funny, I tell my customers the big difference is, I think, working with Mercedes and being, uh, selling the product is Mercedes, um, I think it's the German culture as part of it, but they're very just uh, detailed in what they do in their training. We have to go through uh, rigorous training courses online to learn the product, and, and uh, we have to recertify ourselves every year, and then if, uh, what's the time frame, three or four years to get the master certification? Yes, yeah, so that's three years. Yeah, three years, and so... And I'm not there yet, Steve, you are, but, uh, but so they put you through rigorous training and it's very interesting because I don't think uh, a lot of car manufacturers do that. So they make you really learn the product. They make you up to speed on the new technology that they're putting in their cars all the time. Because as you know, Mercedes are the innovators with all their technology, especially their safety technology, and they want you to be up to speed on it. And so um, it's a little different. Uh, um, it kind of makes you more of a professional. Um, you know, and I think the customers appreciate that also. Awesome, I, I agree with you, James. It's a, it's a really an honor to, to pass some of those tests and, and feel uh, qualified. Let me ask you one more question, James. What's your favorite car? I'd have to say the CLS. Uh, <laughs> Why is that? I don't know. I just think it's a gorgeous car. I think it looks different, uh, different than all their cars. Uh, I think it's got a more aggressive look, especially if you're a guy. I think it's just more of a manned up look. Uh, I love the car. I know you like it too. But, I do. Uh, and it's fast, and uh, it's just a great all-around sedan. I love it. So. Any uh, shout-out you'd like to say to our customers before we end this video? Um, 
I think you should come down and drive all the new product because we got some great stuff, especially uh, that's, uh, I think the misnomer with Mercedes is all their products so expensive and I think it scares people from coming in the door, but I mean, they're doing some really cool things with uh, some of their product that's, you know, in that thirty to $40,000 range and I think it's worth coming down and checking out. So, awesome. Hey, thanks so much, James. You bet. Thanks, Steve.